film definitely pays homage to the TV show. I mean, we're we're certainly referencing it. I love the show. We got Mr. Rourke in the white suit. We got the seaplane arriving, guests getting off. They say what they want. They get what they need, right? But we offer a, a unique Blumhouse twist on the fantasies where they get a little bit darker. We're leaning in a little bit more into the, the edge that was present in the show. I love twists and turns. It's really, that's that's it. I love a movie that keeps an audience guessing, that, that plays with their expectations, that, that drops little breadcrumbs and gets them leaning in, gets them thinking one thing, reveals something else. For me, just as a fan of movies, that's what I like to see. So when I'm making a movie, that's what I try to do. Dude, it's called Fantasy Island, not Ugly Island. So I had to get a very fantastic looking cast and they are not only uh, really nice to look at, but they are incredible actors. They're so talented. The performances are emotional, memorable, unique. Um, I really just am in love with all my actors. I think fans can look forward to having fun. It's a big, crazy genre mashup. We're referencing action movies, comedies, other horror movies. Ultimately, they kind of get wrapped up into this edgy, dark Blumhouse story. But I think at the end of the day, it's just a roller coaster and they're going to really enjoy themselves. Audiences can expect the unexpected.